Hey guys and welcome back to another episode. I'm doing this one by myself. Sophie is the cameraman today, or camera woman. She's got a cup of tea, nice woolly jumper. It's pretty chilly and mudgy, if you can tell. <laughs> <laughs> nah, so we're doing a big trip. If you don't know already, we're in Mudgy at the moment and heading to South Australia. So we're doing a bit of outback New South Wales and into SA. So I thought I'd do a bit of a quick check over the car, what I do before a big trip. We're doing over a thousand Ks. I think it's about 1300 Ks, give or take. Depends if we go here or there. But yeah, it's about 1300 Ks we've worked out so far. So you want your car, your tow rig, immaculate. So let's run it through a bit of maintenance with me. First of all, I check all the wheel nuts are nice and tight. I go and check every nut on the wheel. Alright, that's all the wheel nuts checked. I never used to do that, but I have had one come loose. I don't know if it was my fault for not checking or when I got a service, they never put it back on because it was just after a service. So I always make sure I check them now. You always hear when you're going on corrugations and that, your light's falling off. I just give them a quick wiggle and you'll see if they're loose. I, I'm not gonna get a spanner in there. I just check, make sure they're not moving around or anything like that because it's way too hard to get the spanner in. This one's not too bad, but the other side, I think I took the bash plates off last time to do it. So I'm not doing that. I just, yeah, wiggle it, make sure, look behind, make sure all the wiring's in tight. No, not loose or anything like that. Same as the winch control box, just check them all. Everything seems pretty tight. Just have a quick look around in where the winch bolts go. That's all good, I'm happy with that. Only thing I didn't check is the aerial. Give that a wobble, get your spanner on it, make sure that's tight as well, because they rattle loose as well. Now I'm gonna pop the bonnet and check the oils and coolant levels. And don't do this when the car's hot, because it'll, yeah, explode. Look at that, perfect. Can you see the fluid just there? It's nice and full. Then make sure you put your lid back on. Push that down. All the caps are different. We've got the Lovells one because we've got the GVM GCM upgrade done. And then you can check your hoses, make sure they're all tight. Make sure you in your reservoir you've got fluids. You won't be able to see it, but down the bottom's empty. And that's the max. We're about here. So that's perfect. You can see it. You can see it. Perfect. Check your hoses. Well, if it wasn't loose, then it will be now. <laughs> oh, okay. And then check the air fuel top. Buds. It's pretty good. So chuck it back in. Pull these wires back in. All right, and then check your brake fluid as well. You've got same thing, they got minimum, max. Make sure it's within it. Yep. Bit hard to see. We'll check the engine oil. Okay. Yeah. Don't let it touch the battery. Unless you want to see sparks. Have fun. Yeah, some pipe. 
some fireworks. Wipe it clean. So, to me, we're a bit low on oil, I reckon. Lucky you checked. Why do you? You wouldn't think so. Just had just, a, yeah, just had a Just serve. had a service. Dodgy mechanic strikes again. <sighs> Don't you love it? So, to me, that's a bottom line. That's a top line, and it was, what, roughly there. Mm. Looks like we'll be going to super cheap all day. That worries me a bit. So what I'm going to do next now, this is why you do it. I'm going to be checking underneath and making sure I can't see any oil leaks. I'll check where I parked, make sure there's no oil on the ground, just to make sure. Yeah, I'm going to be needing some oil. Why is it up the top part? It's just would have touched somewhere. Getting a service. Um, I had a spare fuel filter, so I got him to change it over as well because it's never been done. As far as I know at Izuzu, they never did it. So I went to this bloke and I said, oh, how often should the fuel filter be changed? He said, every second service. We've done 80,000 Ks and it's never been changed. So he popped that in for us. Check all my dodgy wiring, make sure it's all still nice and tight. So just give the battery terminals a wiggle, make sure it's all tight. It's all tied up nicely. Yep. The earths. Yep, so that's all good. Now I'm gonna go underneath the uh, car and see if I can see any oil leaks. Probably won't take you along because it's probably too hard. You try. I'll try. As you would have seen, I just went under the car. I didn't see any oil leaks or signs of oil leaks, so I'm not sure if we're burning oil or if the mechanic didn't top it up right. So I'll go to Super Cheap or somewhere tomorrow and get some oil, top her up and I'll keep an eye on it. Alright, next thing you check is your brakes and suspension. Not much you can do with them, just have a quick look around and you would have known we've had brake issues before about going down Mount Oosley. So doing that, we got the front brakes upgraded to heat treated and bigger rotors, which disperses the heat better. And since getting them done, we haven't had any issues going down the hills now, but we've also culled a lot of weight out of the car and van. Now we're pretty much legal, but this will be in another episode. So that's what I do for a pre long trip check not even a long trip, if you know you're doing towing anything, just have a check over, that's what I do. If there's anything else that you check, let me know, then I know what to do next time. Thanks for watching this episode, guys. See you next week. Don't forget to subscribe. Beautiful solid panels. Can you see them? Yeah. Can you ever? All right, my friend. <coughs> I'll just hide the missing paint. That's all right. You can't see it anyway. This is going to be quite big. Do you know how many Ks it is? No. No, me either. So no, we're I'm leaving Mudgy. Go away for Sophie now. It's probably my fault. I should know these things, you know. Ginge, what are you doing? <coughs> Ooh, la, 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 la.
Yeah, we just worked on these. A bit dodgy. Very dodgy.